in this example number four, we're asked to replace the force couple system to equal opposite parallel forces with an equivalent couple applied at point B. So note that the forces are aligned such that they are 20 degrees with respect to the horizontal. This uh, distance between B to C, or that line, is at 55 degrees from the horizontal, so that leftover angle is 35 degrees, and then that direct distance from B to C is the 270 uh, millimeters. So we need that perpendicular distance between the forces. We need that little right triangle there to give us our distance D. D then would equal 270 millimeters times a, let's see, we're opposite of the 35, so sine of 35 degrees. That equals 154.86 millimeters. Right? And so then the moment that we're looking for then is just equal to the force magnitude times the distance. The force magnitude is 40 newtons times a uh, distance that's now 0.15486 meters. So I converted millimeters into meters and then times the 40 and we get 6.19 then newton meters for the moment. Note that that's acting in a clockwise fashion. And it wouldn't really matter whether it was point B or point C or point A, this force couple would have this equivalent effect on the body no matter where we actually wanted to find this moment.